Otis Smiles Dental Bus and Care Mobile traveled the state offering free dental care to children up to age 21. And recently, Dakota Smiles and Care Mobile hit a huge milestone, providing more than $10 million in dental care to more than 22,000 children in 74 different counties, communities, excuse me, right here in South Dakota. News Center 1's Anya Olverson reports on these special buses that could be considered a modern day tooth fairy. If a smile is worth a thousand words, the Dakota Smiles Dental Bus is worth its weight in gold. These buses provide kids ages 0 through 21 with free dental health and hygiene, and often this treatment is life-changing. We had a young lady come in and she had, unfortunately, she had a lot of dental treatment to do, and she was a great patient, but afterwards, after she was pouring numb and everything like that and had to eat lunch, she came by yesterday afternoon and said, thank you for my teeth, and that, that right there made it the whole week. You know, makes us, you know, the hearts just patter. And I mean, this is why we do it, because we all care about the kids. Many children in South Dakota struggle in school because tooth decay impacts a child's overall health and well-being. Many Dakota Smiles patients say they've gotten used to the tooth pain and are just trying to live around it. About 10 years ago, some dental professionals decided to help these children with this impressive mobile dental program. I think it's just huge. Being the school nurse here, I see um, tooth pain on a fairly regular basis. So it's great to be able to have them come and um, be able to make some progress uh, because a lot of these kids just don't receive routine dental care. Typically, kids are treated in a state-of-the-art mobile dental office. However, this trip to Custer was a bit different. Because the bus is in for repairs, Dakota Smile set up in the Custer Elementary School Library. It's for the love of kids that makes this job well worth the hard work. The kids. Um, there's at least one every week that I think I would like to probably take home <laughs> that touched your heart really. You know, they get to you whether it's a smile afterwards or it's the hug later or it's just a simple wave on the playground when the bus leaves. Delta Dental is the main supporter of the program and Ronald McDonald House gives financial support too. To get the bus to come to a community or school, that site must pay $2,500 to have the bus in for the week. For these Custer students, one woman's generosity brought smiles to many at this school. Uh, I think as a, as a child, I had terrible teeth, and I know my parents really had to uh, uh, sacrifice a lot. And uh, I guess that's why I, th I think it's important that kids get this dental health, because it's so important to their general health to have good teeth. I think we um, all have a need and, uh, and, and, and certainly should support the, the needs of our communities, and I'm just blessed that I can do this. Okay. To find out how to get the Dakota Smiles bus in your community, go to our website at newscenter1.tv and look for the Dental Smiles story. Anya Alverson, News Center 1. Thank you, Anya. And if you have an idea for our weekly community connection, we'd love to hear it. Just log on to our Facebook page at facebook.com slash newscenter1. Leave us a message with some details on a community.